Hey everyone, Edgy Berserker back with Street Fighter EX 2 Plus. This time I didn't stumble and almost said Alpha. Yeah. <laughs> so, we left off with Pullen Perna, Narata Darun Mister. Darren Meister. Or Darren Meister, that's fine too. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe like this game's going by way too quick for me, I feel. This is in Mortal Kombat 1. I mean, Mortal Kombat 1 has only eight fighters, but man, it's just, it's Final zipping round. by. Mike. I'm actually super excited, <laughs> though. Um, by the time, yeah, you know what? This posts up all I would have uh, fit, did some uh, DX hurt, which I'm excited about playing because, goddamn, that game's fun and I enjoy it. It's like, uh,. It, it's one of those ones so where you can see that smart. Takara was actually legit trying to figure out the Saturn. And they almost figured it out, like, look-wise. Because, you know what? DX Sword, despite Final being a little round. clunky in that, Mike. is actually a nice-looking fighting game. Especially when Saturn, for the 3D stuff especially, is often said the not not superior version. But there really was something about that Saturn 3D that's uh, differs from that PlayStation 3D, but also in turn is different from that N64 3D. Like all three of them kind of like figured had a style, and then somehow they. If you amalgamated them together, that's when you started getting more modern 3D happening. It's kind of neat. It's like both all sides were figuring out shit, and it was cool. I liked it. Oh, I love old ass games. Just always visit them back, anyways. Okay. Oh, I just boom that one. Probably would have been perfect if my get didn't wreck it with that one gauge thing, but whatever. It's fine. We like the room. He's a cool guy. Shit with him, but you know, whatever. It's fine. <laughs> I tried to learn him in Fexel, but man, I, I had a hard time actually figuring out characters I wanted to play in that one. Like, that I would like playing. And honestly, I think Sharon, who is going to be way later in this playthrough, is uh, someone that I think I will get to enjoy a lot. Crash us! <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, how could I hate this guy? He's a crotch stress. That's awesome. Lariato. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy's awesome. <laughs> I mean, you guys look at the mustache. It's amazing. This dude knows style, y'all. Vega even gets offended, but he's just gonna have to deal with it because he's a posh bitch. <laughs> Final round. Let's get him. Ah. Yo! Oh no. It's okay. It's okay. Ow! That's okay. I got Russell Moose. God, I watched the. Uh, when. On the day of recording this, the day before, I watched the most recent. Uh. Dark Side of the Ring. And it was the one on Owen Hurt. And. Good lord, that one. Still stings to this day. Still. Like, god damn. It's one of those things that I just, I remember exactly where I was when I found out the news about that. Cause like, my parents were cheap, so they would not get the pay-per-view. <laughs> so it's like, okay, well, I'll just keep an eye on this old wrestling forum. <laughs> Cause we didn't have the Twitters and whatnot and social media. And so uh, then I see on there suddenly Owen Hart dead. I'm like, what the hell? I remember I just kind of stayed on that weird internet loop that you stay on when you find out crappy stuff. And I got no sleep at school because of it. And I went to high school, you know, and went to class and all that. But yeah, I didn't really talk about it because no one I hung out with, which wasn't many people at that time, I might add, really cared about wrestling, so I was just like, I'll just keep this to myself then. <laughs> uh, and then just learning things that I didn't know was just like, Jesus Christ. And one point that was brought up that actually made me go, wait a minute, yeah, hold on. 
It was basically an active crime scene. Why was it not stopped? Because they could have gathered evidence while it was fresh. <sighs> so effed up. So effed up. But yeah. Yeah, even the one before on Legion of Doom made me cry so hard. <laughs> Paul Ellering, still remembering to this day the, uh, the, uh, eulogy he gave animals. Just like, oh, my heart. Oh. Man. Wrestling's sad when you actually look behind the curtain. <laughs> like, goddamn. <laughs> I still enjoy it. <laughs> I'm a part of the problem. <laughs> Actually, I'll admit, I haven't really watched a lot of WWE recently, though. I make I catch clips here and there, but I haven't actually sat down and watched stuff. And, and I'm just behind on AEW. <laughs> I'm just behind. So I gotta catch up. <laughs> but yeah. God damn. Ah. Yeah! German suplex, baby. Yeah, I bring up the sad subject as I play a cool wrestling character that yells out Laurietto. There's no way for me to roll, which kind of sucks. So I have to kind of jump in awkwardly because there's no run on this boy. He's a big chunky boy. Oh god, come on, Darude. Darude, not Darude. Sandstorm, no! Okay, I'll be back. Crotch thrust! <laughs> that was a knockout. Okay, let's watch that solo. Ugh! The power of his cock compels us. Yeah, check it out. It's strong. <laughs> this one's Zanky, vent about muscle power. Hot damn. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh lordy. Final round. Fight. Let's fight M. Bison. He's a bad boy. Bad boy drug dealer man. I wants to take over the world. Why did I start out so simply? Fucking drug dealer. Then he becomes a dictator. And then suddenly he's like, I'm gonna take over the world. And it's like, what the fuck, man? I mean, work ethic, but jeez. Ow. What a sweet play. <laughs> yeah, it worked! <laughs> My name's Edgy Berserker, and I can't believe that worked out rather well. Oh. Yeah, sweep the leg, Darun. Oh my god, they even throw his, like, bulge so powerful, because they knew it was iron. Fucking iron, cause it'll knock you out, it's a super. Just thrust that. Oh my god. <laughs> Edgy's been distracted, send help. <laughs> yeah. And on that distraction notice, where they actually did kind of render his bulge here too. Fantastic. This is Edgy Berserker signing off, and I will see y'all later. Bye now.